வணக்கம் தலைப்பு ஈக்குவிலிபிரியம் ஆஃப் ரிஜிட் பாடிஸ் த கண்டிஷன் ஆஃப் த கொஸ்டின் இஸ் गिवन லைக் திஸ் a weight of 1000 newton supported by two chains as shown in the diagram determine the tension in each chain so this is a question diagram given like this and asked you to define the tension tension is the string ac and bc and this is a weight suspended called 1000 newton this is a this 1000 newton is acting downwards okay so for this diagram we going to find the tension or the force in the string ac and bc So usually for question of this type, a free body diagram is constructed. So let me draw the free body diagram for the given diagram. That is question diagram. So free body diagram. So at point C, we going to consider. This is point C. the force which acted downwards is 1000 newton so unit of force or the load this is a load or suspended weight of 1000 newton is acting downwards from point called c and this is considered this is the tension in the string called t suffix bc tension in the string bc and another string which carries a tension that is a uh, tension is a type of force tension in the string b ac ac okay so um, we going to find the various angles subtended by the strings that is the angle at this point this angle this angle and these angles are going to be found out that way by applying lamis equation or the lamis theorem we going to find the tension in the string ac and bc in terms of newton the unit of force or the load is newton express here it is newton the same unit will be for this tension part tension bc and the tension in the string ac so by pop no na enna pannu na first we going to construct uh, after drawing this diagram we going to find the various angles subtended by the string so let me draw a line like this passing through point c at the horizontal line okay so we going to find this angle This is, this is having 90 degree. It's a quadrant. It's a this is vertical line and this is horizontal line. So this angle will be 90 degree. Looking onto this diagram. So diagram part we are going to find out. This angle is 90 degree. That is going. That is for the right side. In the angle, we are going to find. Will be same as uh, left side. So in the angle will be 90 degree. Understand? So remaining angles find out. We are going. That is this this angle and this angle. We are going to find out. So you're looking at this diagram. Diagram, what are they? This is a quadrant. The horizontal is vertical, 90 degrees. So 90 minus 30. You know, in the angle is 60 degrees. Understand? So in the side, parve, left hand side. This is our quadrant, 90. 90 minus 60. This angle will be 90 minus 60 will be 30 degrees. Understand? So if we all angle add, then we get the total angle in the circle will be 360 degree. You can check it again before drawing the free body diagram. So 90 looking from in this direction, power up into 30 plus 60 plus 30 plus 60 plus 90 plus 90 will be 360 degree. So our angles, what we found is right. Understand? So now you put these uh, various angles. What we found earlier in this diagram. You are going to tension the string T A C and B C. If you are going to put angle, you are going to put angle. This is only moon line that is that is a chain. These are called as chains. B C and A C are the string, or here it is given as a chain. Okay, in elastic string, that uh, uh, otherwise we call as a chain, which will have links. So you are uh, Chain is over chain BC, and this suspended weight is also a chain. So in the angle level, look at that is uh, 60 plus 30. In the angle level, the angle ACB, ACB will be 60 plus 30 will be 90 degree. Then uh, this angle will be that is BC suspended weight. But then 60 plus 90, that is uh, 150 degree. Then in the bottom part, AC suspended weight in the angle level 90 plus 30 will be 120 degree. Understand? 
Understand? So after drawing this free body diagram, that is 90 plus 150 plus 120 will be 360 degree. Understand? So if one day, if one day point called B, this is A, and this is suspended weight of 1000 Newton. So by applying Lamis formula, by applying Lamis theorem equation or formula. Understand? So we are going to find the tension in the string AC and BC. So we are uh, so by applying Lamis theorem, what it says the force or the load act divided by sine of the other two. Uh, forces, other two forces, that is 1000 divided by 1000 opposite linear number 90. Irka. So 90 na sin 90, you have to put it as sin 90. 90 is equal to, so TAC, this is opposite, that is TAC divided by sin of other two forces. So uh, TAC opposite linear number, in the angle, irka, 150 degree. That is TBC, 1000, this is not angle, 150. So sin of 150 degree is equal to tension in the string BC divided by sine 120. So equating the first part and second part we get these are the cross that is uh, 1000 by sine 90. Sine 90 is 1 is equal to T A C by sine 150. So if we cross multiply, we will get TAC, tension the strain AC, that is TAC is equal to 1000, that implies 1000 sin 150 by sin 90, understand? So we get less uh, 500 Newton. So TAC will be 500 Newton. So the unit of tension here it is expressed in terms of Newton because the load, whatever the load unit will be applicable for the tension in the string AC as well as tension in the string BC. Similarly, I'm working out uh, these two, two equated thousand. That is second part I am working out to find the tension in the string T B C. So 1000 sin 90, 1000 divided by sin 90 is equal to T B C by sin 120. So on cross multiplying by by cross multiplying we get TBC is equal to thousand sine one twenty one divided by sine ninety. So the whole TBC will be eight sixty six. So using a calculator you can find this value. So the chain. Uh, which carries uh, suspended weight of 1000 Newton so that the chain which carries a, that is AC will be 500 Newton tension in this chain will be 500 Newton and the tension in the string BC or the chain will be 866 eight, uh, Newton that is 866 Newton and here it is 500 Newton this is suspended weight of 1000 Newton understand so, Nandri Valtikal.